Hi, I'm Jerry James Stone, and you're watching Cooking Stone. In today's episode, I'm going to make you one of my favorite things. Well, let me just step back a second. Okay, so I love pizza. I mean, who doesn't love pizza, right? Like, you kind of have to, like, everyone loves pizza. So the best thing about pizza is the next morning when it's cold and having it for breakfast. And so I've often wanted to, like, make a breakfast pizza. But it seems sort of silly to make pizza and then refrigerate it only to eat it for breakfast. Uh, it just seems like a little weird. So I decided if I'm going to make breakfast pizza for myself, I'm going to up it a little bit. And that's what we're having today. We're going to have this cauliflower crust breakfast pizza. So I recently put out a call to you guys asking you what you want to eat. And you were super responsive. It was great. There was a lot of different variety of things, things I don't usually cook with, which is the reason I asked, because I like kind of being forced outside the box a bit. And but the Tuba Geek, which I don't know your real name because everywhere I looked on Google+, Plus, YouTube, you just had the Tuba Geek, so I have to call you that. But Tuba Geek asked for a cauliflower pizza crust, and so this one is for you. It's this amazing cauliflower pizza crust. It's filled with herbs, lots of flavor, but it's a breakfast pizza instead of the typical pizza. And, um, well, it has a fried egg on top, and everything is better with a fried egg. So let's get to making it, shall we? I'm just going to carve off these florets. Then we're gonna add these to our food processor. Now we're gonna go ahead and rice the cauliflower. So we have our, our rice cauliflower here. Uh, the first thing that we're gonna add to it is some uh, chopped herbs. And like always, I will put a link to the full recipe in the show notes. So don't worry, you can just sit back and drool right now. Then we're gonna add in some Parmesan cheese and a beaten egg. You know what, we need some more cheese. How about a bit of shredded mozzarella and whatnot. And we're just gonna mix this all together to kind of create a dough. And this will roll out to a couple different pizzas, about six inch pizzas, which will then put a fried egg on and whatever the hell else you want to eat. Got that Tuba Geek? Now we're just gonna roll out our dough and just kind of shape it into you know, about six inch little pies. I kind of just flatten it out. And then I go around with my hand and kind of give it a little bit of an edge there. And we're gonna bake these first just to crisp them up. And then after we bake them, we'll add on the toppings. So these are ready to go, um, nice and crispy. So now we're just gonna put some uh, marinara sauce on them. In fact, I have uh, a recipe on the channel for a tomato sauce, which is what I'm gonna be using, which you can use. It's really simple and easy to make, very tasty. Dress it as you would any other pizza. Now we're gonna add our cheese. Because we're gonna put a cracked egg on these, is you wanna kinda create a little bit of a well for the egg to reside in. And this is where the egg will sit and then the whites will fry up with the cheese and it'll be super, super tasty. So let's crack our egg. And it's okay if it runs over a little bit. Bake this in the oven again until the cheese melts, the whites are set, and breakfast is ready. I'm gonna add some fresh herbs here. Like I said, this are, these are really great for leftovers, so you can really just add anything that you want on top. That looks pretty darn tasty. Now get the hell out of my kitchen. 